NBC5's First Morning Chief Meteorologist Tyler, Jan Tyler Jankowski joins us now. Tyler, it was a pretty cool scene at Lake Champlain earlier today. Yeah, one of the wildest days I've seen on Lake Champlain. Not necessarily dangerous, but very mesmerizing to see these videos that came in and pictures. This one here is a drone shot high above Shelburne Bay. Big thank you to Russell Fox for sending this in. We've got the steam fog pouring to the south. Shelburne Point there and then Red Rocks Park in South Burlington. So just a stunner there and another picture in from Jeffrey Trubish looking over the lake with the uh, murky clouds there, steam devils, and in some cases a water spout. Oftentimes some opinion involved in what you would call those, but they were very high and lasting over several minutes and very cool to see that. Now the records are in jeopardy in a few spots tomorrow morning, especially in Plattsburgh. Forecast minus 17, record minus 20. We've got a minus 17 forecast in Montpelier with a record of 21 below. Mount Washington right now sitting at 45 below zero. That's just the regular air temperature. Temperature. If you want the wind chill, it's minus 106. So we have records that might fall all across the region. So we've got the very cold tomorrow, a little bit better by afternoon, and then warmer as we get into Sunday 37. So you can still pick out some of these weird low hanging clouds coming off of Lake Champlain. And I want to show you this video that we took earlier from the top of Church Street. This is our camera and that is a pretty impressive water spout there. Middle of the screen moving to the left, sustained over many minutes connected to the clouds. We also had this steam fog in Shelburne Bay and look at the slurpy water there. You can almost see how cold it is just by looking the icicles there on the bottom of that very icy rock. So for sure it is going to be a cold morning on Lake Champlain. We'll show you the numbers right now. 25 at the base of Whiteface Mountain, 23 below. I should say these all have minus signs. Might as well just agree at this point that they're negative numbers because we don't have any positives out there. In fact, look at St. J. feels like 44 below zero clouds, but no snow. So that's not, you know, making the roads slippery. It's just very cold. You can even feel the cars having trouble in this temperature. Clouds come in by uh, afternoon tomorrow and then on Sunday. Sunday's a cloudy day, but it's a lot warmer. A couple of snow showers as we push into northern New York in the afternoon on Sunday. But the 37 will feel like spring at that point. And then next week, look at all those 30s and 40s. Looks largely dry now, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. But again, 42 Tuesday, 42 Thursday, still close to 40 by Friday of next week. Alice?